so the next successful story on uh, shark tank india is beyond snack so i haven't found uh, his website i mean but he said like they have a website maybe it would have been down but uh, this is what uh, the beyond snack is basically they are completely into kerala banana chips and uh, they are available in uh, i think uh, three flavors and and uh, i hope you can relate this to your uh, banana i mean your kerala friends like who are bringing the banana chips as uh, i live i lived in uh, chennai for a couple of years i remember that few of my friends whenever they go to kerala to their hometown they come back with banana chips and which are locally made and you know how the locally made chips are they use they are they use reuse uh, the same oil for more than uh, one month and uh, they don't follow any uh, any neatness and all while preparing the snacks and all but still the banana chips are very tasty so that is the reason we don't uh, bother about how they are preparing and we'll just have it so seeing this as uh, a problem beyond snack manas madhu has invested lot of amount and uh, started uh, preparing these banana chips and uh, he made uh, these are available in four flavors original style peri peri salt salt and black pepper and creamy onion so in 1.5 years of business they have sold somewhere close to 140 metric ton of banana chips and uh, they are their main differentiation between normal local wala product and this is a thin slicer so if you see the local chips they are generally of hardly i mean they will have a more thickness so that whenever you eat you can't eat them with your front teeth either it has to go to the jaw or to the inner teeth so that like again the problem starts uh, for the teeth problems will start but with this the thin slicer is being used so that you can um, you can chew it with your front teeth as well and uh, the monthly sales are clocking somewhere close to 20.6 lakhs and uh, between the four flavors original is around uh, is holding around 50% of the sale and 30% for peri peri 15 15% for salt and uh, black pepper and creamy onion and this particular product is costing somewhere close to 80 rupees mrp and uh, with a retail margin of 48 percent and online margin of around 54 percent so generally like if it comes to i mean if you remove and if you see the net margin is coming somewhere close to 10 percent and uh, he has already went for with a series a round of uh, funding of 1.4 crore for 15% uh, equity and uh, his target is to i mean if if these are prepared at a, at a larger scale the chance of moving the gross margin from 54% to 80 is possible so th- while keeping this as a reason and uh, there are if you if you see the kerala banana chips are are the hot uh, i mean after potato chips these banana chips has a higher market like if you see india wide so for this anupam and pius has uh, shown their interest for 50 lakh for 10 percent uh, of equity and then ashner and Aman came into picture and uh, they have uh, provided they have accepted the ask of 50 lakh for 2.5 percent uh, equity by hearing this like uh, even manas was excited and uh, he uh, he he shown interest and uh, he i mean uh, he was okay with the deal of uh, 50 lakh for 2.5 percent equity provided by urshanir and aman at a valuation of 20 crore so are you interested to have to taste these banana chips do let us know in the comment section